Hi, I'm Ryan Stewart, a developer evangelist for Adobe. Here at South by Southwest, we've been talking a lot about the multi-screen workflow and what Adobe is doing to help designers and developers create multiple applications for different screens or different devices. So what I want to show you is a feature that the team has been working on in Flash Professional to make it easier for designers and developers to collaborate and build applications that can span multiple devices. One of the things that we've done is we have created kind of some enhancements to the Flash project. So now when you go to the new menu, you'll see this Flash project there like it was before. But if you create a Flash project, and I'll call mine mobile, mobile app, and I've already got a root folder set up, there we go. You'll see all your files listed, and you'll also see this author time shared assets.flow, which we'll talk about in a second. So I've got a bunch of different mobile apps, specifically or mobile flaw files, specifically for devices for different resolutions. So you can see I've got one for 480 by 800, kind of the typical mobile smartphone screen size. I'll go ahead and open up. And we've got our assets there. We've got our timeline that still works just kind of the way we would normally have it. And so we're going to build kind of a native mobile application out of this. But one of the things that's critical when you're trying to create an application that will span multiple devices is to make sure that as you change screen resolution, the application kind of changes with it. For instance, if I want to take this and turn it into a, an iPhone version or iPhone 4 version where we have a bigger screen resolution, I can now easily in the properties panel change the dimensions to the iPhone 4 dimensions. So I can just switch uh, you know, 600 or switch 900 here. Uh, or if I want to do something that's a little bit more complicated, um, I can have my application change the scaling as well. So let me open up my iPhone 4 version quickly. So go to my project panel again and open up this 640 by 960. And when this opens, you'll see it's the exact same one that I had before, the same 480 by 800. I haven't changed the resolution yet. And so if I change it there uh, to match the iPhone 4 resolution, 640 by 960, then it'll change the stage size, but my content stays the same, which is not going to be that helpful if I want to take this content and put it on a bigger resolution device like a tablet or the iPhone 4. So what I can do instead is click this little configure button, and as I change these dimensions here, uh, 640 by 960, I now can enable this scale content with stage. So if I check that and then click OK, it'll rescale not only the stage, but all of my content as well. So now I can quickly deploy this to a bigger resolution device. One of the other key things that's important when you're building multi-screen applications is the ability to share assets across multiple devices. You want to make sure that you create a unique file for each kind of device you want to target that takes advantage of the screen resolution or takes advantage of the specific device capabilities, but there will be a lot of shared assets that you want to use across those different devices. So in Flash Professional, one of the features the team has been working on is the idea of an asset shared library. So in this author time shared assets .flaw, we can store all of the things inside the project that will be shared across every single file in that project. So if I go to the library, I've got this link up here, and if I click these, it will share them to that authoring shared library flaw file so that if I open up, say, the tablet version, this 600 by 1024 version, and any changes that I make that use those assets will change in my tablet version as well as my iPhone version or my uh, smartphone version. So hopefully that feature will make it a lot easier for you guys to start creating content that spans multiple devices with Flash Professional. Stay tuned for a lot more information on how Flash Professional will help you build multi-screen applications.